Um, YouTube has told its creators by emails that they're going to start removing content about election fraud. Uh, even though at the same time that there are still active court cases. Uh, is that the most mind-boggling thing you've heard today? That YouTube is literally going to decide what the truth is. And then they're going to take... The, then they're going to remove from your site the ones that don't match their idea of what is true. Now, I'm going to admit, uh, and remember, I said this from the start, that at least 95% of all the claims of fraud would be BS. At least 95%. Would you say that that has borne out? That at least 95% of the claims you've seen, claims, have turned out not to be what you thought they were? I think so. I think I, think I hit that prediction pretty well. About 95% are not true. But are they all not true? <laughs> Can, can I not do a, uh, is, it, is it not good for me to do a YouTube in which I say, you know, these areas had uh, results that have a one in, one in one quadrillion odds of being natural as opposed to being a, a sign of fraud. Can I not say that? Will, will I be demonetized or removed from YouTube if I say the following statement? Because I'm going to say it right now and see if I get removed. So I'm going to gamble, uh, gamble a little bit of money here uh, on this. Would you like me to gamble in front of you? All right, here's my statement on election fraud. Because of the nature of our election systems and what we've learned about the, at least the potential for fraud and what we've learned about the hatred for Orange Hitler, given that setup, there's a guarantee of widespread fraud. It's guaranteed. It can't not happen. So there's a direct statement about election uh, fraud from me, very direct. It had to happen. It exists. It's real. There is no uh, evidence I'm aware of that we can identify specifically enough of it that it would win in a court case or overthrow the election. That's true, wouldn't you say? I mean, we, there are a lot of you who think, well, we're close, or maybe we'll get there, or I think you know, one more day and we'll have it. But as of today, we haven't seen anything that would change the court. We have seen things that at least some members of you know, Congress and the states are saying, the Republicans anyway, are saying maybe we should not certify or maybe we should question the result, etc. But that's just the news. The regular news is reporting that there are some people talking about that. So, will I be banned from YouTube for saying what I just said, which I don't believe has any question to it, that the setup gives the opportunity for fraud, and given the motivation, it's guaranteed that it happened. We just don't know the specifics. That's all. And it probably can't, can't be reversed. So we'll see. Let's see what uh, happens there. That's your little test.